The next two questions are personal questions directed to each of you only. There will be no opportunities for rebuttals. So let's start with you, Governor Abbott. Uh, University of Houston political scientist Brandon Roddinghouse said the following, quote, in Texas politics, it's adapt or die. Greg Abbott didn't start his career as a right-wing Republican, but he certainly ended up there. Governor Abbott, you signed a law banning nearly all abortions without exceptions for rape or incest, and a law allowing the permanentless carry of firearms. Critics, including some members of your own party, say you have moved too far to the right. Have you moved too far to the right, Governor? You have 60 seconds. Well, let's, let's look at uh, the issues that you brought up, and, and that is, uh, for one, uh, as a Catholic and my wife and I, we've been pro-life our entire lives, so much so that it grew even stronger when we adopted our daughter. On the, the day she was born, I was the very first person to hold her after she was born. And I've seen firsthand the power that adoption can have. And it just further strengthened my belief in the power of giving life to every child possible seeing how it can happen so successfully. And I want others to be able to have that same sense of joy, not only that my wife and I have had, but also that our daughter has had. In general, one thing that we've been able to achieve across the entire state of Texas, we've ensured that we provide opportunity for everybody. Governor, as we gather here tonight, Texas ranks number one in jobs created by black business owners and jobs created by Hispanic women business owners. Governor Abbott, just 10 more seconds. Uh have you moved too far to the right, though, in, in recent years? And what I tried to explain to you, Gromer, is that I'm governing from principles. Uh, I'm not looking uh, at changing and co constantly flip-flopping positions like other people do. I'm governing from my principles. Thank you. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.